from league playoffs, we shift now to district postseason tournaments, the first of which gets underway this Thursday with quarterfinal action in 3A boys volleyball. Seven teams qualifying here in 2021, with EPC tournament champ Emmaus earning the number one overall seed. And with that, the Green Hornets also earning the only buy out of the opening round. As you see, Emmaus already slotted into the semifinals. There will be three quarterfinal clashes coming up on Thursday. The two through six, seven seeds, I should say, the other six remaining in the District 11 3A field in order. Parkland, Whitehall, Northampton, Easton, and Nazareth. Mentioned quarterfinal action will get underway this Thursday. The final four will take place on Tuesday, May the 25th, with the District 11 3A Boys Volleyball Championship set to take place live on the Service Electric Network coming up on Thursday, May the 27th. The trio of local boys volleyball heavyweights of Emmaus, Parkland, and Whitehall have combined to win each of the last 10 district titles. The Green Hornets have won five in total, while the Trojans have earned four and the Zephyrs a pair. The second seeded Trojans last claimed district gold in 2016, when Parkland capped the run of three straight district crowns. The 18 and two Trojans will face seventh seeded Liberty in Thursday's quarterfinals. Parkland took both get togethers with the Hurricanes during the regular season, including a four set triumph in the regular season finale, which featured just one of only eight sets lost by the Trojans during the regular year. Liberty enters the district field at 8-8 eight and eight overall after faltering in four of its final five regular season outings. The Hurricanes have claimed one district boys volleyball championship in program history, that coming back in 2007. Now the winner of that match will then face the winner of the 3-6 showdown between the Zephyrs and six-seeded Nazareth. The Blue Eagles are currently 12-8 and eight overall after a first round exit in the EPC tournament at the hands of Emmaus. Whitehall, meanwhile, is 16 and 2 as the Zephyrs set out to defend their 2019 district crown. The only other time Whitehall claimed district gold, that was back in 2010. Now, before Friday's EPC semifinal setback to the Green Hornets, the Zephyrs had won 16 consecutive matches and only dropped six sets all regular season long. Whitehall and Nazareth met just once during the regular season, a three set sweep by the Zephs in early April. The last quarterfinal on Thursday will feature fourth seeded Northampton hosting fifth seeded Easton. The K Kids enter the district field at 15 and 5, while the Rovers are 11 and 7, with neither team having ever won a district boys volleyball championship. Northampton and Easton did meet once during the course of the regular season. That match going to the kids in three sets back on April the 14th. Mentioned the trio of Emmaus, Parkland, and Whitehall having won each of the last 10 district volleyball titles. The last team that wasn't the Hornets, Trojans, or Zephyrs to claim district gold was Freedom back in 2009. That was the last of four titles in a six-year span for the Pates. Meanwhile, the last team that wasn't Emmaus, Parkland, or Whitehall to even make an appearance in the district final? Well, that was the Liberty Hurricanes back in 2016. Liberty, Nazareth, Easton, and Northampton trying to rewrite the recent record books coming up in District Boys Volleyball. Again, quarterfinal action getting underway this Thursday. We'll wrap this.